Mission. Right now, the hunt is on for a man who got into an apartment and touched a woman while she was in the shower. Good evening. I'm Angela Taylor. And I'm Brett Conley. Orlando police released this composite sketch and a picture from surveillance video. As West 2's Gail Pascal Brown reports, residents in Thornton Park are on the lookout. It's too bad that it's happened because it's put everybody on alert. It is the attempted sexual battery in Thornton Park this past Friday. A woman staying with her sister in the 1100 block of East Washington Street went for a run at Lake Eola Park. That's about six blocks away. Orlando police say she'd been visiting her sister and didn't have a key. When the woman returned home, she took a shower. While taking a shower, police say she saw this strange man in the bathroom. She said as he grabbed her butt, he said, come on. She noticed that the suspect had his pants undone. She began pushing him out of the apartment. Apartment and closed the door. It's shocking because this this neighborhood is so quiet and lovely to walk. It's a great walking neighborhood, and you know things happen anywhere though. So I feel completely safe in this neighborhood. Uh, it was probably an isolated incident. The neighborhood itself, where we've been working on, and have gotten a lot more lighting on the streets. The attack was not on Monday night's agenda of the neighborhood association meeting, but we asked residents about their concerns. Of course I'm concerned. I mean, you know, I've lived in the neighborhood a long time before it's as genteel as it currently is. And even so, you know, we've had numerous break-ins, we've had fires. The suspect is described as a black or Hispanic male, about 24 years old, medium build with short braided hair. We show this sketch to residents. Actually, he, he does look somewhat familiar. I, I haven't seen anybody that looks like that, but I'll be watching for him. The suspect was last seen wearing a black shirt or hoodie with riding on it and possibly a white t-shirt underneath and jeans. The victim says that he was also carrying a backpack. If you have any information, call Orlando Police. At Police Headquarters, I'm Gail Pascal Brown, West 2 News.